Qualtrics is kind of the tale of two companies. You know, when we first started, it was my father and myself, and my father's an academic researcher. He had this idea of the robustness of what this platform needed to look like. How do we make it so it's kind of sophisticated enough for the most advanced researchers in the world, but also easy enough for an intern or an undergraduate student to go run a project? You know, everyone wants to predict virality, which is really hard to do. I mean, we hope that there would be a trickle-down effect, but we never imagined that the need we were solving would be at the forefront of the insight revolution today. Today, over 8,000 organizations worldwide use Qualtrics, including 99 of the top 100 business schools, which is great. That's how I was first exposed to Qualtrics. I was a student at Stanford, and lo and behold, the, the absolute de facto tool to use was Qualtrics, which means the next generation is being trained on Qualtrics right now. Two-thirds of the Fortune 100 rely on Qualtrics to solve some of their most complex business needs. So they do market research, they engage their employees, they deliver world-class satisfaction. So they use Qualtrics across the board. All your data and insights can live in one place. And what happens is you find out that maybe the fastest way to move your net promoter score 10 points is to move your employee engagement score 2 points. Those are intrinsically connected, and when companies standardize on Qualtrics, they start to see those connections and how they sort of benefit the organization at large. We pride ourselves on moving really fast. We build something, and within a day, within a week, someone's using it. A lot of the best ideas of Qualtrics have come from our customers. Listening to our customers and starting there and working backwards ensures that what we're building actually solves problems. Dashboards are an exciting product because they empower you to deliver insights across your entire organization. Mobile has changed the way that we work and communicate. For this reason, dashboarding and other Qualtrics products we've optimized to be an amazing mobile experience. And our offline app allows you to collect data from anywhere in the world, with or without connection. Your data is then synced back to Qualtrics the moment you're online. We obsess over being the absolute best, and it's exciting to think about where Qualtrics will be in a year. At Qualtrics, we don't have your typical support team. These are individuals who are extremely well-educated. They come from the top universities across the world, graduating usually the top 10 to 20% of their class. 15% have master's degrees. Uh, it's a very highly talented and well-educated group. We also augment that education. We put them through approximately four weeks of dedicated training. So we at Qualtrics really view customer obsession as a guiding principle for us. As a company, every quarter we review all of our employees based on the level of customer obsession. If we're the gold standard as a product to handle customer experience, um, we better be the gold standard as a company to be able to support our own customers in that way. Or we should have no business being in that space. So as we expand around the globe, we've met that need with offices on site, on ground, close to our customers. Everyone's trying to be a little bit smarter about the decisions they're making. And what's so cool is whether it's your customers, your market, or your employees, Qualtrics is applicable to all of them. We're the only company that's doing it successfully at an enterprise level on one single platform, which is pretty exciting. Qualtrics becomes a one-stop shop for everything data. 